A ver, vamos a ver qué onda. Va a estar comiendo como siempre, así que... Lo siento. Acabo de llegar hace 5 minutos, así que vamos a cachar qué onda. ¿Qué es esto? Xenoblade. One day, Pyra just disappeared. This is where you were. Pyra! Sorry, Rex. I couldn't tell you. Because... I got an invitation to join Smash! Huh? What? LOL. Pyra. Oh, I thought I was gonna be in Smash. LOL. Leave it to me, Rex. Spectacle, aren't they? Wait, grumps? Uh, I've missed this old buddy. Mind if I watch a while? Oh, look, our friends are here, and there's a boy. Esto hay en este mundo. You're all mine. I'll lend you a hand. Sacred arrow. Unscrewed. Burning. Expected to see you two again. Well, now that you're in Smash, I won't go easy on you. Ooh, fighting words. You forget. We're fighters too. Cineblade Chronicles 2. Hola, Frank. ¿Cómo estás? Por un momento pensé que no estaba en el juego. Hello everyone. It's been a while. Bueno, quería ver la, poner la, la, la versión en español y la versión en español no me deja tirar por atrás el directo, así que tengo que ponerla en inglés. Year, we delivered some news through a series of Nintendo Direct mini presentations. 
However, we haven't been able to present a Nintendo Direct in this style for some time. I'm happy to share this Nintendo Direct with you all today. We appreciate your continued support. Okay, what you just saw was the reveal trailer for the newest fighter in the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate game, Pyra and Mithra. They originally appeared in the Xenoblade Chronicles series as Rex's two-in-one ally. Please look forward to seeing their moveset in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. This fighter releases in March, so we hope you'll stay tuned just a bit longer. All right, let's continue with our first batch of Nintendo Switch headlines. Fall Guys en Switch. Espero que la gran crossplay porque si no va a estar complicado. toward greatness when Fall Guys Ultimate Knockout comes to the Nintendo Switch system summer 2021. You have 22 minutes before the solar system is destroyed. Oh, the other, the other worlds? The other worlds. Venture into the vast reaches other of worlds. space to uncover oh, no, the other cities left behind the other by worlds ancient the civilization. You have 22 minutes. After that, the sun will explode and the solar system will be annihilated. However, everything will reset, allowing you to continue exploring while retaining information you gathered. By repeating these cycles, you'll gradually unravel the mysteries hidden in the universe. What messages will you discover? How can you prevent the sun from exploding? Why is the solar system trapped in an endless time loop? Find out when the critically acclaimed Outer Wilds launches on Nintendo Switch, summer 2021. Put your sleuthing skills to the test in two classic murder mystery games. Famicom Detective Club, The Missing Heir, and Famicom Detective Club, The Girl Who Stands Behind, two deep cuts from Nintendo history are coming to North America for the first time. Localized in English and modernized for the Nintendo Switch system. Suspense, drama, and twists and turns await at every corner. You'll be on the edge of your seat as you dive into these deep narratives set in Japan. In one game, you'll solve a complex murder case surrounding a wealthy family in a haunted village while dealing with amnesia. But that's not the only case to crack. Oh, son dos casos, la concha de mierda. In the other game, you'll investigate a supernatural rumor after a mysterious death to free students from a sinister nightmare. Interrogate suspects and hunt for clues to piece together these Por lo menos tiene animación y movimientos de bonito. Can you figure out who the culprit is before it's too late? Kurasai. No, casi la chupa. Uncover the deadly truth in Famicom Detective Club The Missing Heir and Famicom Detective Club The Girl Who Stands Behind. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. A new age of battles begins. Se supone que este día dura 50 minutos. No, no, no.
Samurai Warrior 5 es un mocho. The latest entry in the Samurai Warriors franchise is coming to Nintendo Switch. Dive into the history of the Sengoku period as the series now shines the spotlight on Nobunaga Oda and Mitsuhide Akechi. The general. Oh, se volvió el género. Unleash high octane moves in electrifying one versus one thousand battles. In Samurai Warriors 5, slashing its way onto Nintendo Switch, Summer 2021. Summer 2021. The fast world of Fadiel beckons. Uy, eso, que se ve tan bonito. After 20 long years, Legend of Mana, featuring remastered mm. HD graphics, is coming to Nintendo Switch. Oh. You'll set off on a journey to find the mystical mana tree seen in a dream. Se Before bonito, discovering man. the world map is empty. During your travels, you'll acquire special items called artifacts. Place them on the map to bring towns, dungeons, and other lands to life. Qué bonito es el juego, man. It's up to you on when and where to place artifacts, as well as how to advance the story. Join forces with characters, each on their own personal quests. Square off against fearsome monsters. Or take a break from adventure and rest up at home. The music has been rearranged for this enhanced version, and you can alternate between the new arrangement and the original soundtrack. Other features have been added. Including the ability to turn off enemy encounters, as well as the new mini game Ring Ring Land. Legend of Mana will launch on Nintendo Switch June 24th. Cari, te recomiendo jugar el Secret of Mana. Oh, creo que el Secret of Mana lo, puede, lo podemos jugar en la Super Nintendo. Y se puede jugar de todo jugar. Creo que no podemos jugar eso. Vamos a ser jaja. Digamos que empecé a jugar Monster Hunter en el celular. Y estoy jugando al primero, me está pareciendo entretenido un juego. Así que de momento voy bien. No he peleado todavía con las bestias. Porque estoy haciendo las misiones básicas para ir conociendo el juego. Pero de momento voy bien. Voy aprendiendo a poquito. Siento que como que tienen mucho contenido y muchas cuestiones, entonces como que... Tienes que ser como perseverante, tienes que estar ahí activo, que estés jugando. Mira, aquí tengo un hijo. No, we can't lose this game. Pull yourselves together. You're not getting it. Tiene que lo los monstruos tienen como varias fases. Tiene que estar guayando, tiene que matar. Como como igual son juegos largos. The rampage. How long do you think it's going to last? Monster Hunter Rise. Esto se lo van a fumar en Japón, hermano, porque en Japón son fanáticos de los Monster Hunter. We should start preparations right away. Y va a salir uno para Switch. Se lo van a fumar de una manera. Marzo 26. Oh, qué bonita, weón. Qué, oh, qué bonita se ve, weón. Se ve muy bonita la, la edición. Muy bonita. Monster Hunter Rise from Capcom. How will our heroes fare against these ferocious monsters? Stay tuned for the latest installment in the Monster Hunter series, launching March 26th. Next. Please take a look at this. Mario Golf. Amor. Mario Golf. 
tee off in the latest installment of the Amor? Mario Golf Mario Series, Mario? coming to Nintendo Switch. Study the wind and terrain. Take your time to think things through. Then Pero el de Real Golf, pues aquí no hay nada de mini golf. De Real Golf. Enjoy golfing with familiar Mushroom Kingdom characters on courses filled with lush natural scenery. Se viene. Se viene o no se viene. Se viene o no se viene Mario Golf. To see how your shot will curve due to slopes. Se viene, se viene el torneo. Let's you examine a course's terrain. These features can help you ace your shots. In addition to button controls, you can also use motion Ay, controls. Ay, qué bacán, weón. Buena. Qué like buena que se va a jugar con el modo con lo. Gently swing the controller to have your character swing in the game, letting you easily enjoy the sensation of golfing. Qué buena. On top of all that, there are several modes with new elements that truly bring the heat to Mario ¿Qué? Golf, including ¿Qué? this one, Speed Golf. Speed Golf. Here, it's always your turn. Everyone tees off at the same time, then you'll race through the course to reach your ball. Give it another whack to get it closer to the hole, then keep going. Todos se va a tomar con una una partida de golf. To come out on top. Your golfing skills aren't the only things at play. Make use of dashes and special shots to beat the competition. <laughs> oh, did we mention story mode? As a me bueno, character, you'll historia. start out as a rookie and develop your golfing skills while interacting with various Mushroom Kingdom characters. Level up with experience points earned during matches. Bueno, then, allocate points to different stats, allowing you to develop your character however you'd like. You can also use your me in versus play. Porque Mario es Naruto. Golfing skills to the test when Mario Golf en el universo alternativo. Swings on to Nintendo Switch June 25th. Pre-orders begin. Para nada, güey, bueno, junio 25 no sale, no se vuelan nada. Un par de meses, güey. The latest game in the Mario Golf series adds new gameplay for multiplayer modes. As well as the familiar golf gameplay with easy to learn controls. Puta, lo único que me interesa de estos jueguitos es que los vayan actualizando, weón, que le vayan metiendo después más mapa y más cositas, weón. Como lo único necesario mantener vivo el jueguito. Let's move on to more Nintendo Switch headlines. Check out these games coming to Nintendo Switch. Return to the unforgiving world of Pandora in Tales from the Borderlands. Play as the Hyperion Lackey Reese. And the quick-witted con artist Fiona as you set out to recover a mountain of cash. Set between Tales Borderlands 2 Borderlands and 3, one. this game includes all five episodes. Este juego murió porque como Telltale sabía que era, los retiraron todos estos juegos, güey. Just a handful of the options. Y ahora como recuperaron, creo que volvió Telltale. Eh, como que ahora todo volvió a la normalidad por así decirlo. From the Borderlands launches on Nintendo Switch March 24th. 32 of Capcom's most beloved arcade classics are coming to Nintendo Switch. Rewind gameplay, adjust game speed or difficulty, and select from a variety of display options to relive that sweet arcade goodness. Get 1943 The Battle of Midway for free, then purchase game packs from the standalone Ghosts and Goblins add-on to build your collection. Local co-op play is also available. Scratch that nostalgic itch when Capcom launches later today. Brains. As a zombie, you just can't get enough. Esto? In this action game from Aspire, you'll build your zombie horde and take revenge on the city by turning humans into your undead allies. Replenish your bodily arsenal of sputum head, gut grenades, and more. Es un antiguo, esto no es de... This city ain't no match for a dead man. Stubbs the zombie in Rebel Without a Pulse eats its way onto Nintendo Switch March 16th. Pre-orders begin today on Nintendo eShop. Esto es antiguo, ¿cierto? Pero tiene gráfico de Play 2 esta wea. It's Travis Touchdown versus Assassins. Wait, aliens? Aliens have invaded Earth. Hold up, is this even the right game? Anyway, after annihilating an entire no city, the aliens 3. have taken over and now host an intergalactic superhero ranking tournament. Eh, digamos que tengo que jugar Normal Heroes 1 y 2. As the crass beam katana wielding assassin Travis Touchdown, you'll need to fight your way to the top to save the world. Hey, 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 not so fast. To enter each boss fight, you have to do some odd jobs around town and earn enough to pay off the entry. You'll then face off against a slew of unusual opponents. Most of them aliens with some crazy tricks up their sleeves. Study their tactics carefully to gain the upper hand in combat. 
with a new and improved death glove. You'll have access to a variety of deadly Se ve raro customizing oh, mi idea. The fate of the world is no nivel visual porque eso so o sea, no nivel uh, de arte, sino que visualmente lo Anyway, it all makes sense. Como que los modelados lands on earth or, you know, Nintendo Switch Uf, August 27th. Exterminate demons in he heaven. As above, so no, below. Why. Why do they need to do something in heaven? Ejemplo. To do someone's dirty work. What? Um. What? Me llama mucho la atención este juego. It's kill or be killed. You won't last long if you can't rely on yourself. Me llama mucho la atención en mi gameplay, weón. Bueno. What the fuck? God's judgment has nothing to do with it. No way. Me lo apunto. Me lo apunto. Me, me llama mucho. Mucho, mucho la atención. Uncover Heaven's Mysteries in Neon White. Coming to Nintendo Neon Switch, White. Winter 2021. Me mucho la atención. The DC Superhero Girls are here to save the day. Hi, everyone. My name is Barbara Gordon. AKA Batgirl. I'm always inventing new gadgets to fight crime. Like my batarangs and backup. This is Supergirl. She's super strong and has heat vision. Plus super breath. And let's not forget Wonder Woman, an Amazonian warrior who wields the lasso of truth. Along with our friends Green Lantern, Bumblebee, and Zatanna, we fight evil supervillains to keep our city safe. But we're not just about the super life. We also have our school lives. And trust me, there's never a dull moment at Metropolis High School. Sometimes it'd be nice to get out of class and do some shopping downtown with my besties. Ooh, and maybe take some photos to share on Superstar Post while we're at it. Hey, hey, I got a comment already. Mi duda es por qué este juego tiene mejor frame rate que el No More Heroes 3. Esa es mi verdadera pregunta. ¿Por qué el No More Heroes 3 se veía tan raro? Y esto no se ve raro. Just gotta make sure no one figures out our secret identities. DC Superhero Girls Team Power heroically source onto Nintendo Switch. Que no somos su su enfoque, cariño. Dejamos que esto está enfocado para los niños. Ready the juice cannons and prepare for battle. Plata versus zombie. Garden Warfare. ¿Y esta guay lo mueve? ¿La Switch lo mueve? Este juego está muerto. Lo van a revivir en Switch porque este juego está muertísimo también. Complete edition. Yo tenía entendido que este juego estaba muerto. Bueno, si lo mueve la Switch. No hay problema. El problema es que no. Según lo que yo tenía entendido, no puede. Ah, mucha gente está bastante muerto, weón. Bueno. Join you in your adventure. Hint, anyone can. Band together on a quest to face evil and save Meetopia. faces. Meetopia is coming to Nintendo Switch. Bruh. Cast me characters in various roles across the kingdom. Bruh. Turn your favorite people into your allies, or even make someone the nefarious Dark Lord. Makeup has been added as a new feature in this game. Glam up your mies and get them ready for adventure. There's also a new wig feature. 
letting you go wild with your me creations and make them even more fabulous. In the world of Miitopia, relationships are key. So consider spending some quality time with allies to strengthen bonds. Listo, se fue. Me los puedo tirar a todos, si me los puedo tirar a todos, me los voy a tirar a todos. Voy a follar con cada puto personaje. Caballito. Listo, me puedo tirar al caballo. Si me puedo tirar al caballo, estoy listo. La sofilia puede llegar a mí. Super Mario themed items are coming to your island. Super Mario Lord. Brothers 35th anniversary themed <laughs> items are coming to the Animal Crossing New Horizons game. Familiar items like the Super no. Mushroom <laughs> and the Question Block can be ordered in game as furniture items. No way. Yeah. So place them however and wherever you'd like. You can also place two warp pipes. Wow. Then use them to travel between locations on your island. Hey, why not try recreating the Mushroom Kingdom? A free update for the game launches February 25th. Yeah, but After downloading it, Super Mario Brothers items will be available via Nook Shopping starting March 1st. Buena. Keep an eye on the official Animal Crossing Twitter account for the latest information. We hope you continue enjoying life on your island. How was that? These collaboration items will be released as part of the Super Mario Brothers 35th anniversary events. Please wait a bit longer for their release. Speaking of which, last week, we had the global launch for the Super Mario 3D World plus Bowser's Fury game. We hope you enjoyed that Mario adventure as well. Next, we have another game to show you. What? Okay. What is that? No sé qué es esto. No, no creo. Algún juego de Square Enix? Maybe. He leaves us no recourse. Swords. Oh, que se ve bonito, concha tu madre. Tiene el mismo estilo del October Traveler. Oh, qué lindo, concha mi madre. Oh, qué hermoso. Oh, qué lindo se ve. Tiene el mismo estilo que el Octopath Traveler. El mismo estilo. No me extrañaría que fuera la misma filial de... De 4 Enix. Project Triangle Strategy. Far, far away lies the continent of Norzilia. Qué bonito, weón. Compared to of salt and iron. The constant feuds among the nations over these precious resources eventually ignited into a great conflict known as the Salt Iron War. Though the hostilities <laughs> ceased with an uneasy El saltiron. Truce, decades later, the flames of war threatened to engulf the world once saltiron. again. You are all that remains. Caught in a tangled, fiery web of plots and conspiracies, a brave group from Glenbrook fights to save their kingdom from the powers that would orchestrate diseño, their man. downfall. Our benefit, you say? In 
this new tactical RPG, battles take place on terrain with different elevations. A character's attack range is determined. Va a ser como final. Oh, es como Final Fantasy Tactics. The range can be extended by attacking with long range weapons such as bows and arrows. Thus, your forces can be extended. Yo no no tenía la oportunidad de jugarlos, los Final Fantasy Tactics, pero hay gente que dice que son muy muy buenos, güey. Muy muy buenos. Is susceptible not only to your initial attack, but also a powerful blow from the ally positioned behind the enemy. Por supuesto, Victor, me vine corriendo, güey, y llegué dos minutos tarde, pero me puse a terminar esta. Charge into an enemy to send them flying into position for a follow-up attack. Bueno, se ve la zorra visualmente este juego. Se ve muy bonito, güey. First casting ice magic on the flames to create water terrain. Then electrify the area with lightning magic. It is of the utmost importance to survey the battlefield before taking action. Muchas gracias, Victor, por esa resub de cinco mesazos. Muchas, muchas gracias por seguir apoyando este canal, Victor. La concha de tu madre. Muchas, muchas gracias. Con tres semanas tarde. Lo importante es que salió. No es lo tarde, sino lo importante que ha salido. Muchas gracias, Victor. Morality, liberty. Mucha, mucha gracia. Collectively, your decisions will establish your conviction, affecting how the story unfolds and who will join the cause. Well, look, it's that look at the visual of the well. It's so cool. Once more, I would ask you plainly. Is you? I'm quite sure it's the same team. Relinquish Prince Roland to Astros. But the art of the drawings. Critical decisions that may determine the fates of nations. Palace match. Yes, they showed the person who played match. It's the Xenoblade Chronicles. Use the information you've gathered to sway allies to war or fight. Ese fue el, el que agregaron en Smash. De momento, no sé si han agregado a otro más. De momento mostraron eso. As more and more critical decisions are made, your journey may take you down paths divergent from those of other players. You will see what true might is. Project Triangle Strategy. Triangle Strategy. Me gustó muchísimo. Me gustó muchísimo. En 2022. Ah, me gustó muchísimo. Es muy bonito el juego. Tiene demo. Sí, es que yo asumo que es, es asumo que es el mismo equipo que trabajó en el Octopath Traveler. Estoy casi seguro que es el mismo equipo. Por el estilo artístico me, su me suena que es el mismo equipo. Please look Okay, let's see a few more Nintendo Switch headlines. Si no llega eso de manda. All hunters, do you have what it takes? What is that? ¿Qué es esto? Star Wars. ¿Un juego de Star Wars? Un de Star Wars. Ah, no pensé que era el de carrera, weón. Puta, pe pensé que iban a ser el de carrera, weón. Como vi la web pasando, dije, oh, va a ser de, van a ser otro de carrera. Pero no sé qué será esto. Clash in this third person shooter coming to Nintendo Switch in 2021. Per tercera persona de disparo. ¿Qué es esto? Do I look at you or the camera? Knockout City interviews, take one. We all play for different reasons. Corgan love battle. Corgan use many weapons. Triple bladed war axe, spear of misery, Hades soul devouring crossbow. A princess is supposed to lead her people, not be stuck up in some tower waiting for a hero. My line of work: bullets are constantly whizzing past you. Flaming longsword, blade of doom. Just once. Just once, I'd like to catch one of them bullets. You know, with my hands. With this crown, I'm gonna lead my team to victory and kick some serious ass. Look, it's simple. Corgan want new weapon. In Knockout City, I'm like a kung fu master. I can catch bullets. Come get some. Las quemadas Son las quemaditas Son las quemaditas, weón Losing to 
a bunch of dairy farmers. Okay, team. They may have won the battle. Let's leave in 3D. Hey, can we redesign our characters? Got a team. Pero aguante let's leave, weón. Aguante let's leave in 2D. Hermano, el meo juego. El meo juego. Knockout City. No, o sea, si están pagando las mecánicas. The fight for survival starts now. Puede estar bueno, Ardo. Hang on tight, because you're all going to play a little game of fate for me. From the creators of the Dungeon Rampa and Zero Escape series comes a fight for your life, literally. Disoriented and trapped in an underwater theme park, the 12 of you, known as the Go-Getters Club, must now survive this game of fate at all costs. I don't want to die yet! Sorry to scare you all, but... The game is cancelled! The game is suddenly called off. You escape the theme park and get a glimpse of Japan, but everyone's vanished. Set off on a captivating journey across the country that blends side-scrolling action with suspenseful narrative. Be the one behind the whole game of fate. As you make your way back home to Tokyo, you'll alternate between working solo and teaming up with the group to overcome challenges and monsters that stand in your way. What awaits you all at the end of your journey? The battle for survival begins in World's End Club, venturing onto Nintendo Switch, May 28. Puede ser interesante, No soy muy fanático, pero. Wield the powers of Olympus with the physical release of Hades. Sí, es como Hades, raro, the critically pero... acclaimed dungeon crawler and recipient of multiple Game of the Year awards, is getting a physical release on Nintendo Switch. This version comes with a couple of extras to assist in the journey Victor. out of the underworld. The first is a PC download code for the Hades original soundtrack. It's packed with two and a half hours of blood-pumping music composed by Darren Korb. Known for his work on previous Supergiant titles like Transistor and Bastion. The second is a 32-page full-color character compendium featuring portraits of the game's oh, vibrant bonito, cast well. of gods, ghosts, and monsters all by Supergiant art director And let's not forget the game itself, offering dozens of hours of exhilarating action paired with a compelling story. Escape the underworld again, or for the first time, with the physical version of Hades on March 19th. Qué bonito, bueno. Me gusta, me gusta que Ninja Gaiden con tu madre vuelve. Ninja Gaiden Sigma, Ninja Gaiden Sigma 2 and Ninja Gaiden 3 Razor's Edge are coming to Nintendo. Quieren un juego peludo? Ninja Gaiden Master Collection. Esta wea es lo peludo. De verdad quieren un juego difícil? Esta wea es difícil. The legendary ninja Ryu Hayabusa fighting against a great evil with battle skills that are second to none. Esta wea es difícil. Arsenal of killer weapons, each offering a playstyle with different set of lethal skills, along with ruthless ninjutsu to swiftly take down enemies. Quickly gauge your opponent's movements es más, lo jugaría, while reaching bueno. fast in frenzied combos. Lo jugaría, creo, creo que esta es la versión para Play 3, así que se pueden jugar, weón. Bueno. Esta wea era peluda, weón. Bueno. All previous downloadable content, including costumes and game modes, are included. Revel in the intensity of Ninja Gaiden in one dynamic collection. Ninja Gaiden Master Collection. Buena, que están los tres, buen, buenardo. Buenardo que va a estar en los tres. Vamos a ver si se lo sacan para otras consolas, bueno, si salen para otras consolas, la raja. Pero muy bueno que esté otro... Vegeta, los lo Ninja Gaiden. Va a sacar DLC, parece. Se supone que este es la historia antes, po. Así que asumo que van a. Se parece que es un DLC. Expansion Pass. Esperemos a que salga completo porque esta vez le van a meter contenido, pero como. Uh, como loco. Así que esperemos a que salga completo y ahí. Compramos el complete. He dicho en Masterpiece. There's even more coming to Nintendo Switch. Bravely Default 2 is almost here. Four Heroes of Light will soon embark on a journey to restore the crystals. 
Use the job system to develop your characters and master the brave and default commands to emerge victorious in turn-based battles. I live to fight. Veterans and newcomers to the series can enjoy this brand new story on February 26th. A new trailer for Bravely Default 2 will be revealed following this presentation. The game can be pre-ordered on Nintendo eShop. An updated demo is also available. The latest installment in the legendary Ghosts and Goblins series comes to life as the brave knight Arthur. Se ve como raro el arte, bueno. No es malo, no sé, pero se ve como extraño, se ve como de papel, como no sé. Es raro el, el, el arte. Local available for the first time. Help Arthur in his quest with one of three supporting characters: Barry for defense, Carry for transportation, or Archie for bridges. Ay, bueno, Ghosts and Goblins cosa. Resurrection launches February 25th. Pre-orders are available now on Nintendo eShop. Nintendo eShop. Eight protagonists, eight captivating journeys. Saga Frontier has been remastered for Nintendo Switch. Travel through a stunning sci-fi world with any of the protagonists, suena, esta, esta, each with their own stories. Esta, with the addition of the playable protagonist Fuse, no, new gameplay features, Yo creo que va por ahí. Puede ser eso, Victor. No sé, es como raro, se ve como extraño. Saga Frontier Remastered is an adventure not to be missed. The game launches April 15th. Apex Legends is storming onto the Nintendo Switch system. This free-to-play battle royale features bueno, el Apex a roster of en una Nintendo Switch, weón, como mierda se mueve eso, weón. Cross platform play and more. All players como mierda moví eso, weón. All new legendary Pathfinder skin and 30 free levels for the Season 8 Mayhem Battle Pass. Te cuenta como for the first two weeks after launch, earn double XP. Te cuenta como hace que una consola cuando vende bien, cómo trasladan sus juegos. A la Wii U tenía más potencia, o bueno, tenía una muy buena potencia. Y le fue mal con los juegos y las ventas y nadie porteaba sus juegos. Y ahora todos están porteando la Switch, aunque peor en rendimiento, weón. Y hacen lo que pueden para poder optimizarla, weón. Es brígido. Es brígido, brígido. Hello there. I'm A.G. Aonuma, producer of the Legend of Zelda series. Zelda. Cari, sure a lot of you saw me and prepara thought los dólares. about the sequel to the Legend of Zelda: Breath of the Wild. Prepara los dólares. Unfortunately, we don't have anything to share right now. Ay, no tiene nada para mostrar. La concha su madre. Development is proceeding smoothly, and we should be able to bring you some new information this year. For now, we'll have to ask you to wait just a bit longer. While you're all waiting, however. This Legend of Zelda game will be coming to Nintendo Switch. Please take a look. Este es el Skyward. El Skyward Sword lo van a remasterizar. Van a remasterizar el Skyward Sword, weón. ¡Ay, el Twilight! ¿O no? ¡Ay, no! Pens ¡Sigue el Twilight! Oh, no, pensé que era el Twilight, la concha de madre. Pensé que era el Twilight. <risa> Como vi el traspaso me dio, ay, me dio cosita. <risa> Pero solo el Skyward. <risa> What you've just seen is The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. This game originally released in 2011 on the Wii console and now it's coming to Nintendo Switch. Dos jueguitos remasterizados al tiro. The Zelda Skyward Sword featured a control scheme in which players would use the Wii Remote Plus controller as a sword and the nunchuck controller as a shield. With the increased processing power of the Nintendo Switch system, the controls here are smoother and even more intuitive. Yo lo, lo voy a jugar porque este es el más infravalorado y yo pienso que es buen juego. Joy-Con controllers. The Joy-Con controller in your right hand is the sword. Swing it to have Link swing his sword in the game. The Joy-Con controller in your left hand is the shield. By lifting the controller, you can raise the shield to block enemy attacks. Ya, y si yo sí lo voy a tener que jugar así. Like using both controllers to wield a bow and arrow. These physical movements add a sense of urgency and tension to combat. But we've also made it possible to play the game with button controls to ensure it can be played in handheld mode or on the Nintendo Switch Lite system. After mulling over how to assign different gameplay elements to different buttons, we decided to apply the sword motions to bien, the muy bien, control. En la Switch Lite. Muy bien. 
Tilt the stick down when you want to swing the sword downward. Va a ser más simple pero efectivo right, igualmente. To the left or diagonally. Just tilt the stick in the respective direction. Buena. Buena, 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 buena. Pensaron en la gente en la Here's Switch Lite. We've been on. Specially designed Joy-Con controllers. Dime que no te compraría estos Joy-Con, la concha de tu madre. The right Joy-Con controller is themed after the Master Sword, while the Dime que no te compraría la, los Joy-Con, la concha de tu madre. The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword, as the game depicting the earliest story in the Legend of Zelda timeline, details the events <coughs> around the creation of the Master Sword itself. We hope that people who play No te gusta tanto el juego, ah, pero los Joy-Con, ah, los Joy-Con al tiro nomás. ¿eh? The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD launches July 16th. Sí, sí, el corte era por movimiento. Creo que por el por eso necesitáis como el Wii Motion Plus porque para darle más precisión al Specially designed Joy-Con controllers will launch on the game's release day at your local retailers. Many of you may only know that the Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword was the last original console game prior to the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild game, and it was still following the established conventions of the Legend of Zelda. However, it gave a glimpse into many features and innovations that would eventually be adopted in the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, using the sailcloth to descend in midair, a stamina gauge that depleted as you scaled walls with vines or ran, even the concept of collecting items to upgrade gear. I hope those of you who've played The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild will give this game a try as well. ¿Tú crees que la gente no lo va a jugar después de haber jugado el Breath of the Wild? La gente le va a tincar jugar este, pues. Por... Please look forward to The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword, Skyward Sword HD. Me el, tri el trigger es un hombre de principio, le gusta el Skyward Sword. Well, todo el mundo como que no le gusta tanto y yo pienso que es un buen juego, no, no lo veo mal juego, o sea, de lo que he visto no se ve mal juego. Mira, yo me quedé con ganas de por último haber visto el Twilight, haber visto los dos en HD. ¿Qué tanto costaba traer los dos en HD? O hacer una, cole o hacer una colección de los tres del Twilight, del... El... Del... Ay... Se me olvidó el... El conche de tu madre, ¿cómo esta wea del...? Se me, olv... se me olvidó el nombre, weón. Gracias, el Wind Waker y el, el Twilight, weón. O sea, el Skyward, el Twilight y el Wind Waker. ¿El Platón 3? Me está igualando que van a hacer un Splatoon 3. What? Van a hacer un MMO de Splatoon. Se viene. Por eso el trigger estaba tan caliente, pues bueno. No, le voy a poner polito. Le voy a poner pelito a la concha, mi madre. Goti. Es un goti ya. Es un goti. What the fuck? ¿Ahora se fueron en la pasta con Splatoon? Como que se fue lo, al apocalipsis. Sí, sí, sí. Pero ahora este lo van a hacer single player? ¿O le van a dedicar más tiempo a la historia? El 2 yo sé que tiene historia, pero el 1 no sé qué tanto tenía LOL. Oh, se fue a la mierda la ciudad, weón. Si vos está todo gris porque tenéis que pintar la ciudad, pues bueno.
me sorprende el poco tiempo que ha pasado entre Splatoon 2 y 3. Igual ha pasado... ¿Cuánto tiempo habrá pasado? ¿Cuatro años? Sigo el 2 de Switch. No sé si se en la Wii U. Back into the Ink. 2022. Qué loco, weón. Qué loco, weón. Igual me gustaría que hicieran una, un apartado solo de historia. We hope you'll stay tuned for more information at a later time. Que lo igual, bueno. Today, we showed you a sampling of games coming to Nintendo Switch. A variety of games are in development. And we look forward to sharing more news with you in the future. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Thank you for watching. Piola, no hubo nada así como extremadamente brígido. Pero piola. Oh, se me volvió todo para atrás. Bueno. Eh, como que nada extremadamente brillo, pero. Pero estuvo bien. Tampoco, tampoco es para tirar cohete, obviamente. Pero estuvo bien. Bien. Así. Bien. Digamos bien. Así que no, no me. No me desagradó. No me desagradó, la verdad. Para nada me desagradó. Para nada, para nada me desagradó. Curioso.